Here are some general and Git improvements of the Eclipse IDE 2019-03. Improvements that were added since the last quarterly simultaneous release in December last year. For an empty workspace with no projects yet, links are provided to create or to import projects. In the Project Explorer, in the Navigator and in other Explorer views. Depending on the perspective, there are additional project creation links. In launch configurations, including external tools configurations, multiple environment variables can be easily copied, either by using the new button or via Control C. This is useful to edit the copied variables in a text editor, for instance, by using Control Alt Down to duplicate the selected lines by using the block selection mode to modify multiple lines together or by using find, control F and replace. These modified environment variables can be pasted back into the same launch configuration. All the variables can be pasted into a Java application, into a JUnit, into a Maven build, or into any other launch configuration with environment variables. In the Git staging view, there is a new button to sign a commit with a GPG key. To enable the Sign Commit button by default, go to the Git configuration, add the key Commit GPG Sign and set it to True. Just a refresh and Sign Commit is enabled by default. The performance has been further improved compared to the last release, 2018-12. For instance, in the Git staging view, filtering works faster now, without any UI freezes. Or for instance, in the History view, when selecting a commit with thousands of changed files, the changed files will be displayed immediately, without any noticeable delay. By the way, speaking of changed files, in the right-click menu, there is a new entry to copy the list of all paths. In the right-click menu of the working tree and all of its content, there is also a new entry, Show in System Explorer. On Windows, this opens the Explorer directly. No need to copy the path via the clipboard anymore. The SSH client, Apache Miner, has been improved and has become the new default. Authentication failures with a Bitbucket server under certain conditions have been fixed. These were some of the general and Git improvements of the quarterly rolling release March 2019. Thank you for watching and happy coding!